The Electric City BMX track is open for business. Races started last week and turnout is at an all-time high. This has been the most people I've seen come out to the track in, in all the years I've been racing. I've been racing since I was eight years old. I think people are really looking for something to do and get out outdoors finally. As racers line up at the gates, there is one person who stands out against the many young competitors. And I don't know if you know it or not, 16 year old kids pretty fast. <laughs> So do you race against a 16 year old? Oh yes, the time? Okay, and they beat go? me. <laughs> 80 year old Charlie Roselle oh, took up the sport go. last July as a way to stay in shape for vintage motorcycle racing. And a return to the track amid uncertainty surrounding the COVID-19 pandemic was a huge relief for the retired educator. Because all my vintage races are canceled, all my winter ones. The next one I'll have is in uh, Lewiston, Idaho. So and that's not until June 14th. So we'll have a lot of racing here before then. Though Roselle might look out of place amongst his peers, he's exactly where he belongs. Well, it's really fun is to be connected to the young kids again in a competitive nature, which very few people get to see that. I mean, how many of us really get ever think you'd compete against like an eight-year-old or a 12-year-old, you know? And it's, uh, it's kind of an equalizing factor. We got kids five years old up to guys 79 years old that race out here, and we have a great community. Tom Wiley, MTN News.